actually, it's because Ava didn't say anything. I told her in her mom's car on her, our way to the party, I didn't really want to see Lisa. That whenever I'm around her, she's, she's really mean to me. And Ava said that I was being too sensitive and I thought maybe she was right. And then we got to the party and we had a lot of fun. And Nina said she was just happy I was there and we were having a good time. And then that's when Lisa started making fun of me. And I wouldn't say Ava like took her side, but she didn't take mine. And that's when I started thinking that maybe Lisa was right and that I was ugly. I don't feel ugly anymore now that we've talked, Mom, but I'm really sad and I think I'm kind of angry with Ava. And I don't know if I want to be your friend anymore. Well, Zoe, I'm your mom, but that's your friendship with Ava. And all I can tell you is what I've observed is when Ava's been to our house and you've been to her house, you always come back happy. And when she's around you, she leaves happy. And the two of you look to be truly good friends. And I think you owe it to her and yourself to talk to her about what happened. And if you decide afterwards that she's not saying the things you need to hear and you don't feel better about what happened, then you will move on. But I really think you should give it a chance for just the two of you girls to sit and talk. There is a chance that she's at home right now feeling just as badly as you are.